So who will be the Bucks' next head coach? That is the big question tonight all across the Tampa Bay area and beyond. Speculation swirling, and it is not a sure thing that the replacement is in-house. News Channel X Rod Carter joining us live from One Buck Place. There was a lot of speculation about, hey, we got the guy all ready to go, Rod, but maybe not. That maybe, maybe not. Who knows? That is a multi-million dollar question. Who is going to be number 11? And of course, as you mentioned, an in-house candidate, Dirk Cutter, the name that surfaced immediately after the announcement that Lovey Smith had been fired, was made. However, there are so many names out there. Seriously, it's like a roster. Just showed from the uh, interest that we've received that people want to come to Tampa and coach. Bucks general manager Jason Light says the search is well underway to replace ousted head coach Levy Smith. Of the number of coaches up for grabs, Dirk Cutter already rising to the top. I haven't talked to any outside candidates yet. Um, we're gonna, we have a plan. Former Bucks head coach Tony Dungy talked to me via FaceTime about the search process and about Levy Smith's firing. I hate to see Coach Smith go because uh, I know I got a cup to you. I thought we're on the right track. Dungy, now a sports analyst for NBC, coached the Bucks from 96 to 2001. He told me the process for searching for a new coach boils down to speed versus quality. The best thing to do is be paid and take time. Don't worry about how fast it goes. Make sure you get the right person who's going to uh, really go along with the vision. So who will it be? An online search will give you every scenario known to man. Every sports analyst on earth has an opinion about this. Here are six of the many possibilities I found. Detroit Lions defensive coordinator Terrell Austin. Two-time Super Bowl champion coach Mike Shanahan. Offensive coordinator of the Patriots Josh McDaniels. Defensive coordinator of the Carolina Panthers Sean McDermott. Interestingly enough, one analyst threw out former Bucks coach John Gruden. And lastly, fired Eagles coach Chip Kelly. Uh, no, I'm so now, let the games, pun intended, begin. And I'm not joking. There's so many names out there, some that will shock you, others maybe not so much. If you just Google it, you'll find out. But I can tell you, we're told that there are two candidates who are actually going to be in town this weekend for an interview. To find out who those are, you got to tune in a little bit later. Dan Lucas will break it all down for you. Keith? I'd heard John Gruden's name tossed around, too. I mean, he's kind of hinted he wants to get back into coaching. It would be interesting. Doubt it, but it's kind of fun to speculate. Okay. Did Coach Dungy point to any specific person, though, that he thought might get this job, in his opinion? You know, I asked him that question, and he said, not at all, because firing Coach Lovey Smith came as such a shock to him. He hadn't even had time to think about that. He was so surprised by this move. Well, he's thinking about it now, as is everyone else. Thank you, Rod Carter, reporting live.